One of my favorite, all-time favorite things is our nativity set this year. We do one each year, and most of you know this, and for those of you who don't know this, the nativity scene started because my mother used to collect unusual ones that she could leave out in our home or at the ranch or in the garden all year long. She would not just bring them out and put little cotton balls around them, you know, for Christmas. Our nativity scenes were a little bit more sophisticated. They were a little bit more primitive, a little bit more rugged. They were cool. This year, this nativity set, I just think is incredibly special. It is sculptural. If you touch it, it is soft. It's the three kings, and then it's Joseph and Mary, and then baby Jesus. And the three kings have crowns on them that follow, if you notice it, it follows the outline of their body, but their crowns are loose on them, and you can just take them off very easily, but I like it when they're on because it just somehow lets you know who the three kings are. Everybody knows who baby Jesus is, but you know, three kings, and particularly on this. I think this should be left out particularly all year long. This is to be a piece of art, it's a piece of sculpture, it's, uh, it's heavy, it's gutsy, it's, it's somber, it's, um, it's in the moment of where we are, and yet it's graceful, divine grace, here it is again. I just see it throughout this collection.